This is Jim Walker discussing using cPanel to set up Cloudflare for users, the advantages and disadvantages. The downsides in setting up Cloudflare for clients using cPanel. Well, one, Cloudflare within cPanel is only useful for clients whose primary domain for SEO is www.domain. If a client uses a domain without www, then the cPanel setup should be discouraged. Likewise, Cloudflare within cPanel will not allow clients to use the universal SSL offered by Cloudflare. The only way is to disable Cloudflare through cPanel, then return to the Cloudflare account and set up domain manually. The upside for offering Cloudflare through clients using cPanel is that if the client's using www as the primary domain, then setup is just one or two clicks. Step by step for setting up Cloudflare for clients within cPanel is described below. Notice I have enabled Cloudflare by clicking the cloud symbol to the right of the domain. Client will then be sent an email for account password setup immediately after setting up their account within cPanel. Here's an example of the email the client will receive, which will then redirect the client to the password screen. And then the client will be shown the login screen for Cloudflare, which will give them the login option. After a login, you'll be redirected to the overview screen for review. Just a few notes. By default, uh, HTTP will be enabled uh, if the server allows this. And if non www domain works, If the non-WW domain is a working domain, then the client should set up a 301 redirect such that all traffic goes to www.domain. Also, website owners who wish to use the Cloudflare with SSL cannot use this option with Cloudflare plus cPanel setup. And sites running solely as non-WWW, like hacker.com, should likewise not use this Cloudflare cPanel setup option. If you've already set this up, it's very easy to disable. Just go to the cPanel uh, page and deactivate the Cloudflare option. This concludes the Using cPanel to Set Up Cloudflare for Users, Advantages and Disadvantages uh, article by Jim Walker.